Hey guys, I hope everyone's having a great day. So I am making this video because I received a few comments today that really made me think and it made me think about a serious predicament that women are actually in women and young girls and unfortunately young girls very sadly, but unfortunately media is very much directed at young women so they don't have a choice. But the fact of the matter is, is that looks matter. And we might not want to admit that and we might not want to pretend that's real but not enough that we're willing to throw it all out the window go to work in our track suits not do our hair and put some makeup on and walk around looking like slobs and bums right not enough that we're willing to go to the grocery store in our pajamas so we do know that looks do matter so None of us are willing to really take the chance and really just all join in together and just fight against this because we're in a predicament here. We don't want looks to matter so much, but no one's really willing to throw it out the window because we know how much they do matter. And for instance, the other thing is, is that we don't take care of our bodies and work hard just for our own pleasure and enjoyment. Sure, I like when I'm walking around the house, I run and I eat healthy and I run like crazy every morning at five in the morning. I freaking run and I do it and I eat healthy and mostly I do it for my heart and because I've got a fast heart. So I try and keep really good cardiovascular fitness, but I do it because I want to look good too. I want to stay in shape. I want to stay in a, with a good body for my age. And that's not just for me. And if anybody lies or if I was going to lie to you and say, it's just for me so I can just feel good about myself and my body, that's a lot of bullshit because I like to look good to other people for my age and be recognized that I didn't take care of myself and I'm fit. So I'd be lying if I said anything otherwise. So when I make videos at home and I'm in my lounge clothes, I'm hanging around. Most of the time I'm wearing a gym top and a pair of track pants or a pair of spandex. And I've had comments saying things like, you should be more, um, more like reserved with what you're wearing on videos. So I get that when it comes to work. You've seen me. I wear whatever I'm wearing when I make videos. If I'm going to work, you see me in business suits all the time. If you watch my videos, you've seen it. If I'm hanging around the house half the time, I'm in a belly top or a gym bra, a sports bra, and track pants or spandex, and that's what you got. Sometimes I'm still in my work clothes and I make a video at home. I am. I'm wearing what I'm wearing. I've made videos in pajamas. Like, I just, when something crosses my mind, I make a video. But if I was going to change out of my clothes to cover up my body because I happen to be wearing a like a tank top and spandex who would I be doing that for because I work hard to keep a healthy body for and I, I walk around and what I find relaxing and comfortable at home and then I make a video and I don't mind that people see that I'm in good shape I work my ass off to be in the shape I'm in so and I don't feel like it should take away from what my message is and what my content is now there's a limit to that if i was dressing overtly sexually or i was posting content that was overtly sexually sexual then that's different that i believe that does take away from your message it takes away from your um from it takes away from your value it takes away from from your like reliability and your trustworthiness just because it looks like your focus is on sexuality but i don't feel like just because i happen to be in a sports bond and track pants that it takes away from my reliability maybe i'm completely wrong but let's be honest like i'm not scared to share that and to be seen in a sports bra or in a belly top and track pants because I work my ass off to have the body I have. And it's not perfect. I don't have a perfect body. You guys have seen it on my videos. I sit down sometimes. I've got a little roll in my stomach or whatever. I don't hide it. It is what it is. I do my very best and I'm honest with what I got. And that's it. But women are at such a double standard. And I'm going to make a video coming up about social media and what we post with regards specifically to Instagram photos and what young women particularly are posting and the impact that it has and I really it's going to be a really important video and it's not going to be right away because I need to think hard and think through this and think exactly the message I want to give and to do it in the most eloquent and quick and reserved way possible but 
I just wanted to get this off my mind that, you know, looks do matter. And women, you know, it's easy to judge us. If, if I show off the body I work so hard for, then I'm a slut and a tramp and, or my, my words aren't valid. My content isn't valid anymore, but what am I working out so hard for? Just me so I can stand alone in the shadows and be like, wow, girl, you look good. Like, let's let's not bullshit ourselves. We work hard and we try and put, make our bodies look good so other people will recognize that we're in good shape and we look good. So, but then if I show it off and somebody happens to see it or you see me make a video in a belly top of track pants, then um, it's not classy and it's tacky and it's trashy. Double standard. One, what line do we fall, ladies? Like, wh which which side or which side of this hill are we going to die on? Because we can't choose one or the other. We're kind of stuck in the middle of both, and it's just a shitty situation for us girls. Anyways, just a point to bring up. Just a shitty situation for women because we really can't win in this one. We can't win. That's all. Anyway, see you later, girls. I'll have more coming up.